Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today we will be taking a look into the tarot cards and oracle cards to check if your person likes you. So whoever is on your mind, do they like you? What's the connection looking like in between you two? I felt very drawn to today, guys, to make this reading for you. I had a really weird dream and um, in that dream I realized that this is something that I have to make for you. It was like a channel message. So I feel very connected today. I felt very connected because I already recorded this reading and yeah, this is going to be a message for you, something that you were meant to hear about this connection. I'm looking down because I'm just lighting up the Palo Santo. I really want to uh, cleanse the area a little bit before we are going to go to the card selection for you. So just imagine that you can feel it, that you can smell the Palo Santo. The energy is now cleansed for you and we're going to go into your reading in a second. Just want to mention that I do offer private readings so if you guys will be interested in booking a private reading with me the link for it is in the description box. I also invite you to subscribe to my channel if you're new as I upload very often here and if you guys have any kind of suggestions for the future readings feel free to leave them in the comment box wanted to say in the description box okay let's just go to your card selection and then I'll see you in your reading this is your card selection so as always what I want you to do is just to focus on the inflow and outflow of your breath for a while. It's going to calm your mind and this way you'll be able to choose the pile that you feel the most drawn to. This is the group number one, group number two, group number three and group number four. So keep your person in your mind, look at the piles and whichever you feel the most drawn to, this is going to be the pile for you. If you already chose your pile, the timestamps are in the description box and also in the comment section. Look for your group, click on the timestamp and then I'll see you in your reading. Hey group number one, so let's find out if your person likes you or not. All right, group number one, so does your person like you? Do they have the same feelings? I gotta say that I do see that this has been going on for a while. So this makes me feel like you guys are friends with a sisterhood card and you've been friends for a very long time already. Um, this gives me the vibes of friend zoning someone. So it makes me feel like you either guys had feelings for this person for a very long time or vice versa. They had feelings for you for a very long time and i say that because i got the card ten of pentacles and to me this is representing some sort of like long-term goal or long-term vision um or something that has been going on for a very long time um so it's either you guys liking this person for a very long time or them liking you since you guys got to know each other uh, or since you guys became close friends. I do feel like this person has seen you being in, in different relationships or vice versa. And I do feel like their feelings for you are slowly fading away. I do still feel like they might be um, trying to fight for you or kind of like wait for opportunity. Uh, and I say that with the Knight of Swords. So this card um, tells me that if there will be an opportunity, if there will be an opening, um, they might make a move. However, it feels like they are just waiting for something to happen and I don't think they will engage on their own. Um, Eight of Cups is telling me that um, either one of you, so whoever is feeling this way, uh, or it might be actually both of you, 
you guys have been thinking about walking away from this person or this person has been thinking about walking away from you because they um they kept these kind of feelings for you for a very long time um and it makes me feel like they're just really tired of waiting or tired of constantly trying to prove themselves or so the ten of wands is in reverse another ten so another completion kind of the ten of wands is talking about feeling very tired and exhausted of the current situation that's why it makes me feel like they're slowly kind of like giving up on this connection um i do feel like you guys might still be friends however I do think that their feelings are slowly fading away because they've been feeling this way for you for such a long time. Um, if you guys feel like this doesn't resonate, it could actually resonate with you, but kind of vice versa. You have feelings for this person for such a long time. You're waiting for opportunity. Um, you're not fully engaging for some reason. I do see with the Eight of Cups as well, guys, that definitely there is emotional bond you've known each other for a really long time so if this is a new person i don't think this is your pile group number one if um you just got to know this person and you're just wondering if they have a crush on you or not this really makes me feel like it's for those of you that have known each other for a very long time at least couple of years so what else do we have we have the card forgiving and learning with this card, it says, as you release and heal the past, you experience more love in your present moment. So I do feel like this person is kind of like forgiving you and learning, trying to learn from the situation. Um, because as I said, they've been crushing on you or they've been just keeping an eye on you for such a long time that they start to feel like it's time to move on. With the getting to know each other, this is just making me feel like uh, once again, you guys know each other really well. You've been friends for a very long time. They feel like they know you very well and maybe that's why they're deciding to slowly walk away. We also have the card Scorpio, so you guys might be dealing with a Scorpio or you might be dealing with a Leo. Um, either way, or you guys might be a Scorpio or a Leo, uh, either way, the Scorpio makes me feel like they have been keeping this feelings that they have for you um, privately. Um, I don't think that they have been speaking with anyone about it. I don't think they've been sharing these feelings with um, anyone about the way they feel about you. Um, this is like having a secret crush and admiring someone from, um, from like a secret place. So um, I do feel like they have been having a secret crush on you. Um, we also have the card Leo. So this makes me feel like Ha, huh, this is a really weird energy because I do see that they're slowly, their feelings are slowly fading away, um, but not fully. And also, as I told you with the Knight of Swords card, that they're waiting for opportunity. So with this Leo card, it makes me feel like they're gaining the, their confidence, um, but still waiting for an opening. So if you guys want to be with them, I feel like you should be the person to reach out a little bit first so they would see that um, that you are open for it. Because it makes me feel like they just feel like they don't want to ruin this friendship that you guys have. Uh, by the way, funny how these two are, they look quite the same. So just wanted to point that out. Um, anyway, so do they like you? I think so. However, this is not going to last forever. And if you guys want to just learn more about it, you can watch one of my previous readings on a similar topic. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this or this gave you some sort of clarity. If it did, just leave a like, subscribe if you haven't yet. Thank you so much, group number one, for watching. Take care. Bye. Group number two. So let's find out if your person likes you or not. Okay, group number two. So... Does your person like you? I do see with a three of pentacles that they definitely enjoy your company and they like working alongside you. 
or that they um, that you guys very often end up being in some sort of a team there is a teamwork involved or you guys work together that's another um, another option here so I do see that they do enjoy your company but since we have three of pentacles this makes me feel like you guys often just see each other when you also see another person so it could be just a friend of yours that is always hanging out with you uh, when this person is around it makes me feel like this person doesn't really spend much time alone with you and this also makes me feel like this is a fresh connection unfortunately i don't think they see you as a any kind of like next partner material um, and I say that guys because I have the ace of cups being in reverse and also ace of swords so ace of swords is telling me that they kind of have like no idea um, they don't know that you like them makes me feel like you guys just have um, a lot of topics to talk about the conversation is going quite well as I said with the three of pentacles um, you guys just are really good with one another but they never really looked at you in this kind of way from this kind of perspective and I also say that because I have the hangman being in reverse which tells me that they see you differently than you see them um, and the hangman is also talking about pause or delay um, but in general yes it makes me feel like they just see you differently I feel like they see you as a friend uh, they see you as a colleague they see you as someone that they can talk with the ace of cups in reverse tells me that there are no romantic feelings here uh, I'm not saying that that their romantic feelings will never be there but for now I don't think they see you in this light they see you this way we also have the card a drift uh, or a drift <laughs> letting go allowing a higher force to take charge of a time um, for a time so this kind of makes me feel like they don't really have any expectations for you they are just letting the time to show what's gonna maybe happen next in between you but they don't really think of you a lot um, in a way like in a romantic way we also have the card let go of control issues allow the situation to unfold naturally so this is what i was actually talking about it feels like they just want to keep this as natural as possible if romantic feel or romantic feelings will come i don't think that they are totally um not for that idea but it makes me feel like it's not something that they wonder about they just kind of let it be as it is they treat you as a really good friend um i do feel like they're they like to spend time with you i also have the separation card so this makes me feel like it's it's either you or them that have been uh lately in some relationship and maybe you guys um one of you just went through a breakup through a separation that's why this person is not even considering looking at you this way because because you guys have been friends and there is just not much to talk about here to be honest what i mean is like they don't really think about it so much because they don't even feel like this is an option um we have we have the card express your love so this makes me feel like if you express um, your admiration for them some things can change but for now I don't think there's anything there we also have the time uh, the card take time to breathe out so it really makes me feel like either you or them just need to focus on them on themselves uh, at the moment and not on looking for love or it's something that is just not on their mind at all we also have the card full moon and Taurus so your person might be Taurus or you might be Taurus and um, this makes me feel like this person is just really focused on um, building their career or so it's like they're focused on the practical approach also uh, in this relationship that you guys have um, and for them I don't feel like being in a relationship right now is practical or like turning this relationship that you guys have into a romantic relationship it doesn't feel like it's something that feels practical to them 
that feels necessary to them like makes me feel like they might feel like this doesn't really make sense right now it's not needed why would i ruin this relationship that we have right now that's why they don't really think about it much i'm not saying that they never will because you know this is the current energy and everything changes but this is what i'm seeing for you group number two so this is all that i have for you guys if you found some clarity in this reading please just leave a like subscribe to my channel as this is helping me a lot to grow this platform thank you so much for watching check out one of my previous readings over here and then I'll see you guys in my next reading. Take care. Bye. Group number three. So let's find out if your person likes you or not. Okay, group number three. So this is a very interesting pile. Interesting group. Let's start by saying that I feel like there is a temptation. <laughs> Definitely. The idea... Um, of your person being with you is very tempting i feel like with the devil card as well this tells me that they find you very attractive and they really like the way you look um, there is the sense of sexual attraction between you guys sexual connection um so yes the devil is talking about temptation we also have the full card and by the way you guys only got the major arcana so this is telling me this is serious <laughs> whatever however this reading is gonna go this is very serious situation here so they they do think about you a lot i can tell you that uh, they do consider reaching out maybe or being with you or just showing you how they feel um nearly on everyday basis lately um i do see that guys because the major arcana but anyway let's talk about it so we have the card the fall so this tells me that on one side they do really want to take the leap of faith uh leave behind some things that just no longer serve them maybe people that no longer they no longer vibe with or some kind of beliefs or maybe judgment of others it makes me feel like they um, do want to be spontaneous they do want to show you how they feel maybe they want to get closer to you but they feel like for some reason they can't and there's constantly something stopping them um because we have the lover's card in reverse so it makes me feel like they're not sure if they can be with you like long term serious relationship i definitely feel like they do want to try it but it makes me also feel like they want to experiment with the experiment card that we have and see how this is going to go but at the same time they are afraid that something is just not going to work out um that the change that there that it will make between you two is going to be something that you guys won't be able to save later um maybe it's because you guys are friends for a long time they just don't want to hurt you so it makes me feel like they do want to try something with you um they one day they're thinking like whatever i'm just gonna listen to my heart and i'm just gonna tell them how i feel tell you how they feel but then the next day they wake up and they're like no i can't do that what if things are going to go wrong like it's not practical it's not going to work out because of x y and z i do feel like there's temptation there is this chemistry between you two they do want to try but but they want to experiment a little so they want to maybe um, go out with you and go on a couple of dates or so but then they don't want you to get so committed they don't want you to get so serious they don't want you to get so attached to them because they are afraid that they might change their mind and then this entire friendship this relationship is ruined so the death card is talking about transition and change that's what i'm feeling i feel like they're just afraid of taking the next step and there is a lot of hesitancy here on one side they might be feeling like they want to you know be with you uh forever or so it makes me feel like they are sometimes 
thinking about you guys being together, you guys living together, but then they go back to kind of reality and they realize that it's not that easy. So I said that because we got the engagement card and honeymoon, um, which makes me feel like they definitely want to spend uh, some alone time with you and not necessarily thinking about honeymoon all the time, but uh, just in general that they want to spend some alone time with you and engagement that sometimes they are thinking about this very seriously. This is definitely one of the most serious piles that we got, even though it's not a straight, yes, they want to be with you. It is a little bit complicated. We also have the card worth waiting for. Divine timing is at work in your love life. So it makes me feel like they might be feeling like it's not the right time. That's why the experiments once again. Um, we have the three cards over here. The first one is Aquarius. So you guys might be dealing with an Aquarius or you guys might be an Aquarius. This is just a confirmation. If not, don't worry about that. Um, it's just a message for some of you, but we have bring love into the situation. So yes, they are thinking about sharing their feelings with you, but once more, they're just not sure. Uh, we also have the card, what do you need to release? And conclusions are within reach. So conclusions are within reach. This makes me feel like soon they might make up your, their mind and they might make a decision about what's their next move move or like makes me feel like there will be more to the story very soon so you guys will realize um, soon what's next basically it feels like the situation is gonna move and it's not gonna be so stagnant um so that's ju just the extra message and with the card what do you need to release they are feeling this way that there is something that is just keeping keeping them away from you so maybe it's something that they have to release on their own some sort of belief or whatever it is or maybe it's something that they are waiting for you to release maybe there is a person in your life right now but that's why it's this is what is stopping them from making the, their decision or so uh so whatever it is there is something still just keeping you away from each other even though i do feel like something's gonna change very soon but this is how they feel about you currently this is the current energy all right guys so that's all that i got for you uh if you found this information this video insightful if you found some clarity in this make sure to just leave a like and subscribe to my channel if you haven't yet as it helps me out a lot share in the comments uh your situation your story if you would like to i love reading your story guys and just getting to know you better but other than that um check out one of my previous readings and then i'll see you in my next reading take care bye Hey, group number four, so let's find out if your person likes you or not. Group number four, so does your person like you? I do feel like there are some feelings. There is definitely a lot of chemistry, but they are just taking their time to get to know you better. And it's not on a level where they right now would do anything to be with you. Um, this is more like just having some romantic feelings and wanting to explore it. Um, so we have the devil card. So this is telling me that there is a temptation. There is a chemistry. They do feel tempted <laughs> to tell you how they feel about you whenever you guys see each other. Um, makes me feel like they feel like they should not like you. However, there is something in this connection that makes them think about it. Uh, so I do feel like um, they are just feeling there is this chemistry between you two uh, and they do think about you they like the way you look they definitely find you very attractive with the devil card so moving on we have the hermit being in reverse so this is telling me that they want to socialize with you more they want to talk with you more they want to get to know you better with the knight of knight of pentacles so the knight of pentacles is to me the kind of a guy that 
it's taking things very slowly. They're perfectionists and they don't want to rush things. Um, they definitely want to offer you something, as you guys can see here. It's like they want to get to know you better. They want to spend more time with you. They want to maybe take you out somewhere, but they don't want you to take it so seriously as well because they want to kind of just check if this is something that they really want to do if this is something that they really want to get themselves into so we do have the card romantic feelings um and give your relationship a chance and this is actually a really good card to sum up the energy i do feel like they want to give it a chance it's not like they're um so fully you know uh, extremely in love with you they want to explore this this area they just want to explore that feeling that they have uh, the judgment it's like they're following their own rhythm they're following their own song they're playing their own song and they don't want this to change they want to just experiment a little give it a chance see how they feel about it but definitely want to socialize with you more that's what i'm seeing with a page of ones they do find you as someone that is extremely interesting it makes me feel like you guys might have um quite similar interests um you might like the same music uh you might just be passionate about uh the same things or they see you and they see someone that is extremely passionate about what they do, someone that is courageous, someone that is very charismatic, and that is something that is interesting them uh, in you. So what else do we have, guys? So we have keep an open mind. So this card is just saying that they don't want to be taking this seriously, but they do like you. I do feel like they like you. The thing is, with a keep an open mind, it makes me feel like there could also be someone else that they have on their mind. That's why they are just keeping it open-minded. <laughs> they want to keep it open. Um, I'm not saying that they will keep it this way if you guys decide to be together, but it's like they just want to explore the feelings that they have for you and I want to see what kind of feelings they also have for this other person. We also have the card Sacrifice. Um, there are those worth making and there are those that will destroy you. So I feel like this is just saying that they are not sure if something is worth sacrificing in order to check if this is the right connection for them. Maybe they don't want to sacrifice the friendship or maybe you guys are hanging out in the same group of people or you guys work together and they feel like they're just not sure if this is worth it. That's why they want to experiment. They want to get to know you. This is quite similar to the group number, was it three? I mean, it's not the same energy, but kind of like experimenting as well. Yeah. Uh, we also have the two cards. Adjustments are required and believe in the impossible. So the believe in impossible is a very uh, encouraging energy here. Um, they might be just feeling like, they they basically feel like they never know that's what they say uh to themselves like i i never know you know i could never know maybe we end up together maybe not it's um they definitely feel like it's possible um for you guys to be together or for you guys to um, just i don't know just make out <laughs> whatever it is um we also have the card adjustments are required so there is definitely something that is just limiting this connection there is something maybe that they have to do on their own they have to change in their life um it feels like it's just not flowing fully like it's not flowing easy super easy uh, so there is, there are some obstacles between you guys. However, just in general, to answer your question, does this person like you? Yes, I feel like yes. Are they in love with you? No. But they are open to the idea of it. And definitely find you very charismatic, energetic, and super attractive. 
so that's all that I got for you guys. If this gave you clarity, make sure to leave a like. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't yet, as it helps me out a lot. Maybe comment down below, let me know uh, about your story, how do you feel about the reading. And watch one of my previous videos. And I'll see you guys in my next reading. Take care, bye.